Hi everyone, so today I'm going to show you really quickly how to add the Google Tag Assistant Chrome extension, Chrome browser extension to your uh, Chrome browser and also I'm going to show you how to add the Facebook Pixel Helper uh, to your Chrome browser. Um, so the purpose of these is so we can uh, use them to validate the, uh, the tags that are firing on our websites um, as well as helping us uh, with making sure that we've set up um, certain tracking correctly. Um, so I'm going to go to uh, the uh, Google website for the Tag Assistant, so Google Tag Assistant. You can get to it by going to the website directly or searching on Google. Uh, so I'm just going to install that. It takes me to the Chrome Web Store and I'm just going to add that to Chrome. Add extension. And that's now been added. I'm just going to click on it for the first time and I am going to just go with the default settings and press done and that's all in place. For the Facebook Pixel Helper you can go directly to uh, this URL uh, which I'll include in a link below um, or you can just search for Facebook Pixel Helper and, and navigate through to it through uh, through Google and then go download now and that also takes me through to the uh, Chrome Web Store and I'm just going to add to Chrome in the same way. Add extension and that's also been added. So to show you uh, how this works on our Chrome extension, now if I just go to a website such as uh, Adidas, and we'll, uh, we should start to see these little uh, Chrome extensions pinging. So for example, Facebook will show us now that there's some Facebook pixel tracking here that's already is implemented on, on Adidas's uh, site. And if we want to use the Google Tag Assistant, we have to click on it, click Enable, and then refresh the page and that should bring us up some tags that we can see so yeah here we go so now we can see all of the tags that are in place on uh, Adidas's website okay thanks very much for watching